Hey, look at what sister did. She stuck someone else's eraser to the ruler. I can't pull it uh, off. The eraser stuck to the ruler? It wasn't me. The eraser stuck itself. Still talking back. Hello, Lou. How can I stick this site? I'll tell your dad. You really can. What? The eraser can not only stick to the ruler, to be precise, it can slowly eat the ruler away. Eat it? <laughs> You're joining in the nonsense too? <laughs> it's true. If you don't believe it, get a new eraser and ruler to test it. Very simple. Put an ordinary eraser on a regular ruler. Set up repeat experiments. Check after a few days if the eraser and ruler have stuck together tightly. What? There's no glue? How could it stick? Just that. Still talking. You're in trouble. Well, they can stick together mainly because of like dissolves like. Like dissolves like? In plain words, materials with similar polarity or structure are likely to dissolve each other. A material of erasers is mostly PVC. To soften it, plasticizers are added, and these plasticizers also dissolve the ruler's material, a polystyrene. So when the eraser and ruler touch, the plasticizer seeps out like oil from a sponge, gradually eating the ruler. So, after sitting up for a while, even without glue, the eraser and ruler can. Oh, they really are stuck. I can't even pull them apart. I have to teach a judge. Not just rulers, even pencils and earphones can be dissolved. Ooh. Remember to store erasers separately. 